So we all know sanding is the least favorite part of it. Pretty well, any, anybody who does taping, that's the dreaded day is sanding day. You wear the little paper masks, that works kind of, but we all know you still are breathing some dust in, your eyes get full of dust, and you just feel gross at the end of the day. So we're gonna give this full face mask a shot to see how much this helps and if it really makes us feel better at the end of the day. So I, I wanna show you what comes in the box. So I picked up two of them today. And so it is the Honeywell full face mask, part number 54001, if you uh, wanna pick one up. And so here's a brand new one, and in the box, what you get is the mask. Comes in this little bag here, which is kind of cool, so when you're done at the end of the day, just save this bag. You can put it away, keep it safe, keep the lens from getting all scratched up, so you have the mask. You notice there's no filters though, because this mask could be used for more than just drywall, so you've got to get the, uh, this, the specific filters for drywall. So what they recommended is the Honeywell P100 filters. So you gotta buy those separately, unfortunately. But so you get the mask, get the filters, and it's a very easy setup to get the filters on the mask. I'll take those out. And they make it pretty convenient. There's nothing to line up, whatever. They just thread it on the filter and on the mask. You stick them on there. Apparently it's harder than it looks. Thread it on. And that mask is good to go. You can see there's four points to, uh, on the straps to adjust. So you get it on your head, tighten it up, and uh, let's see how it works. So as far as comfort goes, it does a, it's really comfortable in the face. It creates a nice seal the whole way around. There's no way drywall dust is getting inside. Vision is good, you can see everywhere. Uh, yeah, so let's see how it works while we're actually sanding. Okay, so we just finished sanding about 13,000 feet of drywall. Um, unfortunately, our planex is broken, so that's why we had to pole sand. So yes, I am still tired, because pole sanding obviously is physically hard, but I do feel good. The, um, I'll start with the cons though. So this mask right here, locally I, just, I bought it for $125. So that's not cheap, but it should last a long time as long as you take care of it. Um, it didn't fog up, which was good, but uh, I did notice it was on my head for a little while. Eventually it kind of went away, but I did, it was kind of tight on my head. So I noticed it for a while, you, that kind of goes away. But I mean, that's not really a con, it's just, you get used to it. Um, when you're sanding ceilings, the dust does land on the visor. So not often, but every, say five minutes, I was noticing I have to put my hand and wipe the dust free, uh, just to keep seeing. But I mean, is that, all that dust that's landing there isn't going into your eyes, so that's kind of a good thing. And so the pro is that it did exactly what I was hoping it would do. It kept all the dust out of my mouth, kept it out of my eyes. Um, so I don't know, overall, I'm really happy with it. Um, it did get kind of warm, so in the summertime, maybe that could be an issue, but you'd have to try it for yourself and see. But overall, it worked well, so I would definitely recommend at least giving it a shot.